What is up guys, Cliff101 here and today I am bringing you Life is Strange, a game recommended to me by my friend Ultima Odin, uh, regular on the channel. And now he has also recommended that I do some video recording of, of my reactions with this and that will be coming but it'll be coming in my next recording session because my camera is not charged and I kind of want to get this started I've been I've had this game for about a week or two and I really want to start it because I've heard nothing but good things about it so without any further ado here we go this is literally the first time I've loaded up the game so I have no idea what to expect so we'll see how we go. Okay. This should be very interesting. I'm, 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 like I said, I've, I've never played this before, so this is a live commentary where I'm not talking about anything that's going on with me, unlike what my sort of Road to Remake series is. Um, I've got no tips to offer you. This is, oh, I'm gonna shut up. just quickly is just adjust my audio settings so it doesn't overpower the voice but I don't want to take away from the music or anything because it could be particularly important so hopefully that's that's quite enough all right camera is funky Can I sprint nope just walking it's pretty cool, like it's obviously not the most spectacular looking game in regards to cutting edge graphics, but I definitely like the dark colours. The storm and the rain is definitely making an effect on the game. It's got the basic necessities that you need, and that's fine. What's this? A skull. Nice, yeah, that's... Good for effects there. Okay. The camera is really, really wonky, I will say that. But maybe it gets a bit better. Where are we and who am I? Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> That's pretty hectic. And it's moving. Oh yeah, you might want to move. <laughs> that was so surreal. Famously called film, little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now. Can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black? I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Weird. Diane Arbus. All right, let's take a look at that. Why Arbus? Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? What the hell even is it? Laughing at me now. Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as torture. I right? can't believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. Yes, you should. I like it old school. Take a selfie. Any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. It's a word for a wonderful photograph tradition. 
funny. Of course, as you all know, the photo Max. has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't resist. Awesome pun. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Oh, no. I should... <laughs> I should have read the journal first. I did know, but I kind of forgot. You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes. A process to give portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Sad face. The I should have read the journal. Brought out fine detail in people's faces. If anybody else looked at this, what would they October, do? my favorite month. The best weather of the year. I love watching the leaves change color. Turning into tiny flames. But it's too damn hot thanks global warming and I can't bust out the big coats and sweaters or scary movies yet soon Kate let me borrow the October country by Ray Bradbury I haven't read much by him which caused Warren to almost revoke my Greek cred before I held up my copy of Battle Royale but he now is the autumn atmosphere of small towns the last time I wore a Halloween costume was with Chloe I have pictures of I have pictures in one of my old albums that's really funny, because that's an Undertale symbol. Just right there, symbol right there. <laughs> I should find a Halloween party to crash so I can experience some social mingling. It's that or a Vortex Club Stroke Fest swimming party. Or is that Backstroke Fest? You're so punny, Max. <laughs> At least I'm trying to climb out of my cocoon. I shouldn't expect my life to completely change after a few weeks of Blackwell Academy. As my parents love telling me on a loop, you have all the time in the world. That's Alright, so are these characters my name is Max Caulfield and ever since no I'm not gonna read these, that's gonna, it's gonna take too long. Episode one uh these must be locations, SMS from Dad. Have a very special eighteenth I'm eighteen, okay. Oh double old all at once from mum Always you okay? Did you, did you like... I can't go up I can't scroll up oh yes I can. Hey Max, you around? Always you okay? Nope, there's nothing there. Mum, Maxine, and Warren. Oh, there's been here. Too. Nothing really in there. Okay, fair enough. Extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype self-portrait. Sorry, Max. No more selfies right now. <laughs> you can find out all about him. And your I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Bag, something in my bag. Oh no, that's class over. Okay. Deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Shut up. I wasn't trying nothing. Why do you have to pick on me? Ooh, there's a computer here. I can actually use the computer. Looks like somebody was already working on this. Cool. Cool, yeah, whatever. I can speak Hi. to you. Oh. Hi, Max. You seem, you seem quiet, quiet today. today. Just thinking too much. I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Oh yeah. Thanks, but not today. I have to go over homework. She's no, totally please. emo. Let's hang later. Sure. All right then. Fair enough. You do whatever you want. Look. Hmm. This might make a cool shot. No, I'll we'll take a photo of it then. Rachel Amber. That's two girls. So there must be lesbians in the class. Tablet? I should have known. She'll have better equipment than Blackwell. Nope. Can't be bothered reading it. Even her school books are gift wrapped. 
Nope. I can't believe she made fun of me in class. What is she, 15 years old? <laughs> should I explore this like an actual RPG or should I just try to do a rush? Mm. Let me let me know what you guys want actually. How in depth of this game do you want do you want me to go? I can look at you, but I can speak to Excuse you. Excuse me. Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Do, Do I, I have, have to? to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. That's what separates the artist from the actor. I'm imagining that this game heavily relies around photo taking and sh and and basically showing, like, uh, obviously every experience is going to be, like every playthrough of this game will be different, and I guess it's going to be. The things that I take photos of that will shape the experience. I was about to. Welcome to the real world. So, yeah. Anyway, let me, like I said, let me know, ooh, let me know um, how in depth you want me to go with this game, guys, because this could, this could go for a while. I don't know how how big this game is. I don't know. Whether 15 minute videos is going to be enough for this, or whether I can like mid save on a chapter or, or an episode, I don't know. Okay, just chucking the old earplugs. That's cool music. Okay. What I'm going to do is leave the first episode here for you guys. I'm going to end this recording now. Can I save it? Resume, how to play, reload, last checkpoint. Okay, so this must be a checkpoint. Uh, I'm going to leave it right here because this is an autosave game. I will let you guys decide for me how in-depth I go with this game. Um, and I will leave it at that. So thank you very much uh, for watching and I will see you in the next episode. Hopefully you guys get on the bandwagon and put in some input and, and be a part of this game and experience with me. Alright, I'm Cliff101 and I will see you guys later. Bye.